Hey, what is up? So I am giving a quick tutorial on a patch editor that I made for a project I was working on where I want to teach someone how to tie a tie. And it turns out to learn how to tie a tie, you need to kind of flip-flop between two sets of instructions to give you sort of this understanding of uh, what are the steps to do. So to do that, I uh, use the patch editor, and I'm going to show you, you know, functionality I use to make that happen and how you could use it for another project you're interested in. So the first step I'll do is I'll bring these two you know planes into play which will show you the first two steps. So I'll bring this up to the top and and what I'm gonna do is flip-flop between this set of instructions and this one. So that gives you an idea of here's the first set. So I'll bring these both into the patch editor. And I will drag this up and so what this patch editor does is it flip-flops between those two instructions and those two images. So we can bind the visibility from this first AND statement to this one, the second one to here, and what we'll see is actually so the value is 1 in this case but if we make it 0 we'll see ourselves flip-flopping between these two steps. And when we want to hit to the next step, we want to flip-flop between the next images, we can make that happen by bringing the visibility of the next plane into the patch editor, and then bind the AND from this third AND to this plane. And now the way this works is as you increase the value, it will flip-flop between the next set of instructions. So you can see how this will continue on. If I want to add my third plane, I go to this plane, and add this as a set of instructions. I would bind the fourth and to the visibility of this plane, and then the ability to show the next steps is two. So here's the second step in production. So you can see if I put in zero, and here's the first. Then you gotta put in one. Here's that second step, a few steps. So this is now flip-flopping between these two. And then when I put in two, it go to those next two. And then, so now that's hitting, going and flip-flopping between these next two. And you can continue down the line. Hopefully that was helpful. Let me know you. If you have any questions.